It happens in an instant. A coyote attacks a toddler and... It happened in an instant. A coyote attacks a toddler in broad daylight in Woodland Hills. Ariel Eliaho had just picked up his little girl from preschool. Now, after taking her out of her car seat, he reaches back into his SUV to grab the child's toys. His wife, Shira, picks it up from there. Have a listen. So for a second, he just turned inside the car and then he just heard her like screaming and he didn't see the coyote. He thought she fell, so he ran over and then he saw the coyote. Shira, what kind of injuries did your daughter sustain? Um, she has a lot of like uh, scratches on her left leg and one of them is really deep actually. So we had to go to the ER, we had to get her rabies shots. Um, and yeah, he just kind of dragged her so her face is also a little bit bruised and Ooh. yeah. Now, incredibly, as our cameras were rolling, a coyote appears in the family's front yard just a moment ago. Neither the father nor her, his father-in-law were having it. They chased after the animal, chased the animal back into the bushes. But this family, they say they are sick and tired of these coyotes up and down their neighborhood street. And if you come back to us live, that is the message they want to convey tonight. They say that they know they live in Woodland Hills. They know they are surrounded by wildlife. They know that this is something that they just have to deal with. But they say an animal like this coming so close to their children, attacking their children, is simply unacceptable. They want the city to get involved. They want the city to come out here and trap this animal and remove it. They think that the animal might be sick, possibly have rabies. Bottom line, they don't want to see this happen to their child or any other child ever again. We'll have more coming up at 11.